welcome to this week's Tech Tip Tuesday at Evolution Equestrian. Today I wanted to go over brushes as we're getting into grooming season with horses shedding. Uh, we're all spending a little bit more time brushing and I just got in some fantastic new brushes that I'm super excited to share with you. Uh, so first off, and most requested, uh, we're going to go over the Occlusive Curated Grooming Boxes. Um, I'm a huge fan of these brushes, so I am super excited to be able to share them with you. Um, I already have most of them myself in my grooming box, um, but basically these curated boxes are formulated especially for different coat colors. Um, as darker horses have a little bit more dander that shows, lighter colored horses have a little bit more stains that show. So they have specially curated different brushes for those different types of coats. This one right here is the universal pack though, so it has all the brushes that they have. Um, so it has seven brushes. It goes from stiffest all the way to the softest ones. Um, so any type of grooming needs, these brushes have you covered. So the stiffest one in this box is for the light colored horses. It's the Schimmel. Um, this is actually one of my favorites. I use it right now every day for pie. It's a great one for getting stains out, um, tough mud. Uh, it's a fantastic brush. And their softest one is called the Polisher Brush. This is the Diva. Um, so it's actually lamb's wool with horse hair. This one is one you want to have in your show kit. So it's going to be fantastic for getting that last polish on. A great way to apply product evenly to your horse. Um, this is not an everyday brush. This is going to be a show special events brush, but it's fantastic. Um, so I do know that these brushes are quite a bit more expensive, not in everybody's budget, um, but that's okay because I do have other options that I want to show you guys as well. So the other brushes that came from the exclusive order are these fantastic Allen Davies brushes. So for those whoops, who don't know, Alan Davy is an Olympic level groom. So he knows what he's doing when it comes to turnout. So this right here is the polisher brush. Um, it's actually very similar to the Diva brush. I'm pretty sure it is the same thing, but it's got the blue lamb's wool and the horse wear, horse hair powder. This is which one they called Mr. Flicky. So it's got a lot of flicks. So you're gonna be able to get that dander from the skin up, right up to the surface. Um, this one's not super stiff. It's actually quite soft um, for a flicky brush. Um, it is a synthetic. And the last one they call the polisher. Nope. This one is, there's Mr. Flicky. I forget, I'm sorry. I still have palm brain. Anyways, this one is a good horsehair brush. Great everyday brush. I really do love a good horsehair brush year round, especially in the summer. It's great for sensitive skin. It's also fantastic on short coats, clip coats. Just got enough flick to be able to get the dirt off, but it's not too harsh, so you can use it all over your horse's body. Another option for a horsehair brush is the ones I have with the winter circles. Winter circles are fantastic brushes for their durability. I also have a variety of them as well in stock. One of my favorites is the Great English one. So this is a mixture of synthetic and gray horsehair. So it's better for like this time of year or winter coats, or if you have a very dirty horse, this one's gonna be your ticket. Um, another option are these tapioca and stiffer mixed blends. So again, this one's not gonna be great for a sensitive skin horse because it is a bit stiffer in the middle, but it's gonna be great in springtime, shedding season, winter coats, because it's gonna be able to get through that thick hair and get that dander and dirt up and off. Of course, you can't complete your grooming pack without a good curry. There are so many benefits to giving your horse a good curry. It's great for their circulation, it's great for their muscles, it's great for bonding. Um, these ones are just basic classic grooming <laughs> curries. You can hold them nice in your hand. They fit well, they shake out, they clean easy. Another one that's fantastic is this little handy brush. I love these ones for getting legs. Um, it's nice little scrub. However, I do find these ones a little bit harder to clean. So if you have tips and tricks, I'd love to hear them. Anyways, those are just some of my brushes that I have in stock. If you have any questions, please send me a message. I love to talk tack. Um, I'm always here to help you. And if you don't know which brush you need, um, again, I'm always here to help. You know where to find me. Just send me a message, shoot me an email, and I'm here for you. Anyways, we'll see you next week and have a great one. Thanks. Bye.